Hello guys, welcome back to a new video. So let me quickly switch the screen here. Yeah. So, so this is the question. Today's question is longest repeating character replacement. So we have already solved this much of all these questions. You can see we have tick mark these. So I have created a playlist. You can definitely go to my channel here and check all these uh, playlist there all these questions will be there uh, you can see all of these yeah so if you are new to the channel consider subscribing I upload these videos daily so yeah let me just jump to the question quickly so that's the question longest repeating character replacement you are given a string and an integer k and you have to choose a string such that you can choose any character in the string such that uh, change it to any other uppercase English alphabet you can perform these for k times okay and the length we have to return basically length of the uh, such string containing same letters or same capital English alphabets you can get performed the above so what what is the question exactly is like for example this string we can convert any of the character uh, into any other character so here uh, for like the answer is 4 because uh, they converted B and this B and this B to A so all these become A A A A and the max uh, length of any repeating character will become 4 so yeah so that's how it is here so that's the question is here you can see uh, the middle of like this B they uh, changed it to A so the, uh, the length of this repeating character will become 4 so a a a a will become the answer so yeah so that's why the answer is 4 so now how we are going to approach i have already written this and this is the code let me just tell you the approach first we then we will write the code and we will see uh, step by step here so let me first uh, go through this code uh, 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 sorry approach so yeah so this is the let's suppose this is the given input string it can be anything i have like amended this uh, this first a little bit to make you understand about this. Yeah, so k is equal to 2 here and this is the i index of every string. Yeah, and we will have two variables length and, length and max, max frequency. So you can see length is here which will be the answer. So maximum length uh, we can get after converting k character so that maximum we form a substring in this given string that have the re repeating characters. Yeah, so uh, then we will have this uh, max frequency which will store well, I will tell you why we are going to store this and what's the use is uh, basically you can see here we are maintaining this mag maximum frequency till now of any character we have seen any unique or different character we have seen and then we will have a frequency map so we whatever character we have seen currently we will increase the frequency corresponding to the letter English alphabet letter so yeah we will maintain a map so that we can have the count of any character till we have seen so that we can update our length accordingly in condition of k uh, changes to the letters so yeah so let's start from the, this zero uh, let me just have a pointer there quickly so yeah this is a pointer so let me just point it to the zeroth index yeah uh, let me just delete this yep so this is currently at zero uh, and the length will be initialized as you can see in the code here it will be zero and the max uh, frequency will be also zero yeah and this is the frequency map we are uh, currently it is empty at, at, at initially and so i equals to currently zero we are standing at this character a so what we will do is we will first increase uh, the we store this in this uh, frequency map and increase its corresponding value or that initializes to one so we have seen one a alphabet or character a yeah and we will update our frequency a max frequency that is any frequency we have seen is max is one so yeah you can see this here here we are uh, updating our max frequency so frequency of c that is c is the correct character a frequency of a you can see is one so yeah max frequency become one uh, then what we will check we will check if the length 
minus the maximum frequency smaller than or equals to k or not so we can at most update k element so yeah we will uh, we will maintain this up, uh, like up, updation by this uh, if condition so length is currently zero so uh, we haven't update our length yet so currently uh, initially the length is zero so zero minus uh, the maximum frequency that is minus uh, this is one so to overall it is minus one so minus one is smaller than k so we will increase the length simply so the length will become one so yeah we will move to the next pointer or the next element that is b so same we will increase the value in the map uh, by default you know in c plus the value of any empty map will be zero so yeah so that's why we are directly using a c plus, uh, plus plus here so zero plus one uh, here will be b uh, one one value against b so yeah so current character is b so frequency of b is one max frequency is also one so may, uh, it will get updated or it will remain same to one so one maximum of one comma one is one yeah and then we will check this ag against this check this condition so length is one max frequency is one one minus one zero zero is smaller than k yes it is smaller so we will increase the length simply so length we will become two then we will simply uh, move our pointer yep so let me check if we are yes we are recording yeah so similarly here a now a is already we have seen so here we are increasing the frequency so let me increase the frequency here so that frequency will become two okay then in the next line we are checking length of max so max frequency here you can see max frequency also after this line max frequency 1 uh, comma 2 max of 1 comma 2 is 2 so it will become 2 so 2 is coming from frequency of current character current characters frequency will become 2 here we increase so yeah max frequency will become so then the if condition if condition length minus uh, max frequency so length is 2 max frequency is 2 2 minus 2 is 0 so 0 is smaller than k so we will simply increase the length so yeah so you can see till now we are uh, started from this b and a so here the length will become 2 and you can see b is not a similar character to a but we have two a's and one b so and we can as, as you can see we can have like two change in values so we have already used one value so yeah so now the total so it will become a so the total length will become 3 so uh, here we will see how it is going to become 3 here now yeah so let me just uh, so we increased I guess we increase our uh, this R2 we should increase this to 3 yep and then what we will do is we will uh, move to the next character that is 3 uh, uh, B and B uh, corresponding value we will increase like this and then we will update the maximum frequency maximum uh, remains two same because max of two comma two is same and then we will check length uh, three three minus two is that is one and one is smaller than k so yeah we will increase the length so increase the length will be four so yeah now we have reached till now so we have consumed two so now it is it will be on c let's see what happens there so here we are in c uh, the, uh, the character is c so let me just do the same thing frequency of c will become one now let's see uh, max is max is two uh, so max of these is two so it, it will remain same as you can see in this line then we will check length minus max frequency length is 4 max frequency 2 4 minus 2 is 2 now see the main condition here 2 is smaller than 2 false it is uh, 2 is not smaller than 2 so we will go to this else condition here you can see old char oldest character so what do you mean by oldest character so current length is 4 so what we will do is we will decrease the frequency of the oldest character so oldest character is like i is we have like 4 and length is 4 so 4 minus 4 is 0 so s of 0 is s of 0 is a so what we will do is we will decrease the frequency of a so 
frequency of A will become this. So we discarded this last uh, or the oldest character. Now we are considering this. Okay. So yeah. Uh, so in this way you can do all this and you will find the length will be 4 overall. So that is the answer. Uh, regard, uh, regardless like we have added two more values C and D I just want to show you how it works after that so that why I just do we can form this much of repeating value like A A A A regardless of any character we add here so that depends on what character we add so I added unique character so yeah so yeah that's about the approach let me quickly add the code here uh, so initially n will be s dot size and then uh, what we have we have a max freak so it will be 0 and then we have the length that will be the max length what we can find so we have to return that and then we will uh, run a loop here i is 0 i is smaller than n i plus plus and we will have a map as I told you an ordered uh, map of care and int so care will be these uh, characters so let what we will name it we will name it a uh, freak freak and what we will do initially we will find the character so it will be like this uh, s of i and then we will increase the value inside the map corresponding to this character and then we will update our max freak equals to max of max freak comma uh, the the character corresponding to uh, the frequency corresponding to correct character in the map and then we will have the if condition if if uh, uh, length minus max frequency is smaller than k then we will simply increase our length otherwise we will decrease the frequency of the oldest character so let me find the oldest uh, character that is i minus length yep s of i minus length and then we will decrease the frequency of this oldest character like this yep let me check if it is working or not yeah it's working for this case let me submit it yeah it's working and let me just check the time complexity and space complexity so time complexity is pretty straightforward one loop that is run for n time and is the length of the given string yep that will be the tc time complexity big of n and then are we using any extra space yes we are so frequency let's say uh, each character in this is a, a, a unique character so it will also depend on the uh, length of the uh, string so and max space complexity will be of n so yeah so that's about this question if you like the if you like the video please hit the like button uh, that will motivate me to further upload videos and also consider subscribing I'm seeing like 80% of people are not subscribing yeah more than 80% uh, yeah so let me just tick mark this yep and I will see you in the next video.